I'm Robin Petrovich. And I'm Catherine Bailey. I'm the managing director. And I'm the creative director. And we're the co-owners here at Heath Ceramics. Heath Ceramics had been started in 1948 by a potter ceramicist named Edith Heath. And she and her husband Brian Heath built this building from a small studio starting in their kitchen to this incredible company that was known for its fantastic design and for its dinnerware. And by the time that we found it in 2002, 2003, uh, Brian Heath had passed away and Edith Heath was already in her 90s. Heath was literally a building that we stumbled across in Sausalito. The paint was peeling, the blue color was fading, and there was dust on the windows. We peeked in. And there was something about it that really spoke to us. It was like opportunity. It was inspiration. And there was old machinery, and it looked like there was pottery on racks, so we couldn't really tell whether or not it was that way for the last 15 years or if something was still actively happening. We didn't know exactly. It wasn't like we saw it and said, we need to buy this, but we want to be involved. When we discovered that this was actually a company that continued to make ceramics, make dinnerware, make tile, right here in the town that we just moved to in Salcedo, we were so excited to have this idea that one could design and make the product under one roof. I remember one day there was outside the store, we have a little courtyard and we put a picnic table out there. And one day I came out of the store and I noticed that there was a whole family and they brought a picnic with bottles of wine and glasses and I thought, this is so unusual but amazing that they would feel so comfortable that they would just do that in front of somebody's showroom. You know, can we recreate that and make that part of who we are? And that's when we thought, let's do it in the city. Let's do it in the middle of San Francisco. Let's go to where our customers are rather than make them come to us. And let's create this space that is both a manufacturing facility and a public space, a gathering space, a community space where we can really share uh, what we do with our customers. We think it's important that the people leading it are owning it. I mean, that makes a family business. You're really, really invested in it. Last year, we started making our employees owners. And so now Heath is partially an employee-owned company with a look towards the future of what we hope to continue for hundreds of years uh, beyond when we're here. We like the way that feels, um, and we hope that that can continue on, but you never know what the next chapter is. 